What's good, y'all? Sean Tom here with some more VR gameplay, and today we are playing The Lab. This is a, a Valve made VR experience. I don't know if I would necessarily call it a game, but uh, it had been requested that I play it, and uh, I love everything Valve, so uh, let's just let's just start it off. Let's see. This is. I don't have hello, hands test here. traveler, oh, and hello. welcome to the Aperture Science Subuniverse Exploration Center. Cool. Oh. Hi. Hello. Wow. I want to go to there. Okay. Can Please I? Please move forward. Please use your spatial reassignment wand to move forward. Oh, cool. This is the Aperture Science Face Mounted Portal Sphere. It is your gateway to a vast continuum of undiscovered worlds. Mmm. Cool. These undiscovered worlds may also contain undiscovered diseases, natural disasters, airborne toxins, and apex predators that hunt humans for sport. Oh, good. Let's, let's put go. Put the portal sphere on your face. I put it on my face. I should have waited. I'm sorry I cut off the, the uh, audio there. Vesper Peak. So, I guess it makes sense that there's no hands. Uh, I'm sh this is definitely made for the Vive, considering that they own Vive. But just uh, when I checked it out, I was surprised that they had it out for Oculus, because I know for a while it was Vive only. Whoa! Hey, hey! I picked these up. Yeah. Hey, 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 get the stick! Oh, man. All right, let me look at my guardian here. Come here, puppy! Give me the stick! Give me the stick! Yeah! Huh. Oh, you can move. Oh, you can move to designated area. Wow, cool. Let's keep going up the mountain. You're gonna have to come get me, doggy. Aw, is this as high as I can go? Wow. Very cool. These, uh... Dog can't get them up here? Or he's trying. Sure he is trying. Where's the dog? I lost him. I can go down the mountain a little bit. Cool. All right. Well, that's a little experience, I guess. That's kind of cool. I mean, it's very nice. I mean, one day, you imagine this was not generated and it was actually like, you know, like a real, real footage of a real place. I mean, this is a real place. Give me this. Give me. Yeah. Oop. Good luck. Yeah, you got it. Well, that is cool. But let's uh, let's go back. What do we got? Let's top button. Top button. Oh, I keep grabbing. using the wrong button to grab. Okay, back to the lab. I want like more of a game type, maybe. I don't know if this has games. I think it's just more of experiences. But of course, I'm totally talking out of my ass. I have no idea what this is really all about. Welcome back, Test Oh, Traveler. cool. What's that? <laughs> Yay! You could just. This is, this is what you do. What you do with it? I thought it was gonna let me like spray paint or something. Secret shop. Okay, there's all sorts of stuff. Let's start. Open experiments name. Okay. What's that one? Is that the one I just did? I think so. Okay, let's. Yep, I don't need this. You can. Oh, I let him go. We what fun? Okay, let's let's yeah. Okay, this looks like a game. Zortex twenty six twenty. I'm just guessing it's twenty six twenty. This is shoot him up, shoot him up, shoot him up. Defend your ship. I don't use my left hand. I don't use my left hand. Oh, okay, 
Okay, yeah, real good. Okay, so that's my ship. There we go, okay. All right, this time we got it. Oh, here we go. Classic. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, this time we're ready. myself playing a little bit more of that it's intense it's really tough well it gets really hard it's cool though all right test traveler has survived a relic expedition in pocket universe lab 8 open experience complete oh is there a okay i see cool Slingshot? Cool. Okay, I'm down with this. I am down with this. Welcome, core calibration trainee. When you're ready, closer, approach yeah. the calibration unit and begin calibrating cores. Okay, Approach well. the calibration unit and begin calibrating cores. I mean, it's too far from me. Can you have it? not approached the calibration unit. Please do so now. Is that what the, I mean? Yeah, see, I can't go that far. The calibration unit is the large calibration shaped unit in the room with you. Approach it now to begin calibrating cores. Nope, I don't, I can't do that. I, I, Literally the calibration do. unit is not the belt currently conveying random objects along its surface. This is a conveyor belt. Do not approach it. Instead, approach the calibration unit and begin oh, calibrating cores. Oh, hey, hi. So excited. Are you the uh, calibration guy? Awesome. Great, great. It's my first time. Uh, pleased to meet you. What's your name? I'm Gil. When does it start, by the way? I mean, oh my gosh, are we doing it already? I mean, did it? Ah! Oh, this is awesome. Oh, 
Hey, hey! Am, am I up for calibration? Oh! oh, this is sweet. Trainee, have I got a deal for you? Up for bid. Go! Oh! That was a bad toss. Two weeks to retire. <laughs> What is that thing? I thought I could blow up or something. I am the Reverse Psychology Core. But don't worry, Reverse Psychology only works on stupid people. Jack me! It does blow up. Released. Alright, so I guess that's what we want. Picture Core! Tracer Core released. Yet will kill us all. Picture Core! Tracer core. Tracer core released. It will kill us all. Hell yeah. Yes. Awesome. Tracer core. Are you gonna hit it? Yeah. Released. Oh, tracer core. I see. It's because it. Tracer it. core. So many tracer cores. I like those. Oh, I should definitely hit those. This damage threat just reached. Sending replacement. Here you are, sir. Whatever else you want to call it, it just feels right. The only thing I know. Ah! Too high. Too high. Way too high. I am the Climate Change Awareness Core. Please calibrate me so that I may call. <laughs> Oh no. Well, we'll blow up. Okay, it wasn't so bad. Get more points for that. Cool. I mean, is there like time or is there an amount of cores that I can use? Is that, is that it? Was it done counting now? Career over. Oh. You are fired. I see. I want to I wanna restart. Oh man, I, I thought I hit restart. I could do better next time. I could do better. Oh, good. Welcome, core calibration trainee. When you're ready, approach the calibration unit oh, and I begin see. calibrating cores. Here. All right, now I'm I'm learning. Oh, hey, hi. I'm so excited. Are you the uh, calibration? Ah! I missed it. Just tilt it over. Oh, Damn. hey, hey. I, I, am I up for- no! Missed it again, damn. I am the executive core. Please action calibration now. Calibration of executive core will be a real game changer. Please back burner other priorities, such as ball parking and blue- Game changer! Oh, I missed it. All right. There we I am the fruit punch core. I am filled with refreshing fruit punch. My tropical- Yeah! Oh. Oh. But don't if worry, you cool. reverse psychology only works on stupid people. I can tell you're far too smart to ever fall for it. So I won't even- Jack me! Oh no, that was terrible! Ah, oh, it was the worst one yet. I am the Climate Change Awareness Core. Please calibrate me so that I may- I hate you, Climate! Oh man! Blew it. Alright, we're gonna have to take- I'm gonna have to really- Do some Career damage. Over. Oh, that was it. You are fired. How come? All right, then I don't know. All right, well, let's just go back to the left. That was, that's definitely a fun one. I like that one the best so far. Definitely the best so far. Test traveler of Pocket Universe Lab 8 has returned from an experiment. Mm -hmm. Experiment Rosen is exhibiting signs of existential Longbow experiment. The, the Ashcam Vector. Connects to a castle under siege where archery skills must defend against a rampaging horror. Comments. Wait, isn't that a recurve bow? Shut up, Daryl. Okay. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh, the puppies are here. Alright. Longbow. Sure.
okay. Alright, let's uh... Oh, hell yeah. Alright, that was bad. Oh, come on. Oh, no! Look at those. Can I get more points for that? Yeah. Oh. Okay, I'm not doing very good. Oh, you back looking son of a bitch. Get anything for those balloons? Oh man, okay. More are coming. Can I change? Oh my god. Wow. Oh man, I didn't know you could do that. That's sweet. Okay, that one's really fun. Alright, we'll move on. I'm gonna try all these for y'all.
Pocket Universe Lab 8 has concluded an experiment. Congratulations, I'm Test very Traveler. Close to my edge here. <clears throat> experiment in Pocket Universe Cycle has been cleared for immediate decontamination in Pocket Universe Lab 100. Robot repair. We will fix Atlas. I wonder if this is the thing, because I remember before the Vive came out, there was like a huge. Uh, well, there was like some sort of VR experience thing that Valve had put out um, where you just kind of stood in a room and maybe you could like move around, but I don't know if you could touch anything, but it was like the whole mind blowing, whoa, this is VR for the very first time type of thing. Maybe I'm just crazy and none of that ever happened and I'm just making it up. Cool. Good job. Great. All right. Robot repair. What do we have here? Hello, repair associate, and welcome to the Robot Rehabilitation yeah, this and is Wellness the thing. Center. Our records indicate that you are the inaugural participant in our Human Diversity Outreach Program. You are holding dual Aperture Science prosthetic multi-tools. Please charge them in the multi-tool charging station. Okay, what did I do wrong? Oh. Charge your multi-tools at the charging station. Okay. Good. Now press the button on the multi-tool. Good. Your multi-tools have been fully irradiated. Please okay. remove your radiation suit at this time. No suit detected. Good. <laughs> there is a cabinet of drawers in your repair station. Please locate it and open a drawer. Why don't you use my back case? Good. Now close the drawer and open the correct drawer. Locate and open the correct drawer. Good. You have now practiced oh, on two okay. incorrect drawers. Please open the correct drawer. Well, it's not a lot. Good. As explained Whoa. in your orientation, you should, of course, never look directly into the drawer. Room sensors indicate you are currently looking directly into the drawer. Mr. You have just interfered with an Aperture Science Pocket Universe capsule. You are now their god. Hi. Close the drawer to initiate Contaminated Pocket Universe Contingency Protocol. Good. Contaminated Pocket Universe Incinerate. <laughs> Opening drawers has been removed from your list of responsibilities. Please locate the service bay door lever and pull it. Uh, I'm guessing it's this. Now serving. One. One. I'm number one. Oh, hey guys. Awesome. Looks like you need some help, Atlas. From the schematic hologram, all Aperture brand robots can be repaired by anyone with even a rudimentary understanding of advanced electromechanical engineering. To begin repairing this unit, attach your multi-tool to its faceplate and pull as forcefully as you may hear what sounds to a human like mechanical screaming. But rest assured, button good. Please locate and press the button marked good. Step two, locate half inch board number 35 pitch sprocket or amp motor D and disengage wow. it from the appropriate linear actuator unless its electrostatic ion reactor is uncoupled from anodized voltage axis circle bracket 733E and only if oxidization valves A, C, F, and H1 but not H3 are asymmetric to turbo pump exhaust manifold K spill it. Please take your time, up to 30 seconds, at which point the thermal reactor currently uncoupled from its heat exchange unit will detonate. Alert plaques and deploy. Cool. This is really awesome. Again, take your time. 15 seconds. 15 second plaques is deployed. Increased heart rate detected. Ocean sounds relaxation plaques and deployed. Oh, I need to be more relaxed. Wait, is that the button? Whoops. Responsibilities have been removed from your list of responsibilities. Core oh. meltdown is supervisor has been alerted. <laughs> I don't believe it. What kind of robot can't handle the simplest? Oh, oh my God. it's you. Congratulations on your quota filling promotion, by the way. You've opened all our eyes to what humans can achieve when you put your tiny little minds to it. Repair station recycling initiated. For your own safety, please vacate this station immediately. Don't listen to him, you'll be fine. Also, let's be honest. Your first day's been a bit of a disaster. It's probably not the worst thing if you die. Whoa. Aperture lab. So dope! Can we walk around a little bit? 
Repair station recycling in progress. I want you to know, at first I was against this human diversity outreach program. But now, watching you flail around like a sweaty pile of ham, I see I was wrong. It's hilarious. Honestly, I think you're overqualified for robot repair. I've got a better assignment for you. Repair station recycling completed. Thank you for your participation. That's a recording. He has to say that. Goodbye. Oh. My. Oh. Oh my god, they need to make a portal VR game. Oh my god. Oh my good god. Oh, I want a portal VR game so bad now. Just seeing that was just, I can't even, I can't even explain it to you. That was incredible. <laughs> My heart stopped for a second there. I literally thought I was gonna let me do like a level. Oh man, why are they not doing that? Why is that not, why are they not funding this? Who am I kidding? There's no way they're not, they have to be. I mean, putting that little thing in the game, everyone and their brother who played this game is probably like, Need some Portal 2 in my life. Test traveler of Pocket Universe Lab right 8 has returned from an experiment. Okay. Test travel. Let's, let's see what's going on over here. The do's and don'ts of test travel. Gavin Goodtest says, I have fully charged my portal sphere. I am in the correct Pocket Universe Lab. The government doesn't know I exist. No one will miss me if I disappear. Looks like Gavin's ready for a science adventure. Bradley Bad Travel says, I can't breathe or see. I provoked a velociraptor. I taught a primitive culture how to smoke. I just gave birth to a velociraptor. Uh-oh! Looks like Bradley just ruined an entire universe. Whoa. Well, it's because I'm facing the wrong way. You guys are all looking at my back. Why is it, why is it? So I need like, I don't have 360, so I gotta like, make sure my arms, you know. Yeah, see, it's, it doesn't like that. Why, why wouldn't? Why would you do this all backwards? Oh. Whoa. Of course I'm backwards, so I can't really take advantage of this. Wow. That's really cool. I mean, you know, I can see, I mean, they put this in here as being like, look at the application VR could truly have. That's cool and everything. Not exactly what I'm looking for in my VR experience right now. But thank you. If I if I stand like this, do you think it'll, it'll load in front of me instead? Please load in front of me, load in front of me. Against well, all odds, matter, test traveler of so Pocket just... Universe Lab 8 has survived. Speculative science coordinators needed for metric expansion in Pocket Universe Lab 100. Solar system. Relic emits a portrayal of solar system. Whoa. Okay. I'm going to turn this way. Okay, okay, see this time it started where I was looking. All right, that's kind of the trick, I guess. The solar system. Whoa. Oh, and of course it's behind me, huh? I wanna like, I wanna, ah. Uh, see other games like let you Say which way you want to look. Okay, I can throw Saturn. See ya. You know, if you wanted to learn about our solar system, so look, just... <laughs> yeah. Well, 
What fun. It's Earth. <laughs> See you later, Earth. All right, cool. Good enough. I think I've had my time in the solar system. All right, Test traveler move on. Only two more left Lab here. Has returned from an experiment. The secret shop. Damn it, it's behind me again. See, it's made for the vibe, which which comes with uh, three or four sensors, right? Doesn't it? Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. But this whole three sensor or the two sensor deal I have, two sensors there, makes it very difficult for me to do anything behind me. Oh, geez, it's freaking out. Come on, lab. There we go. Whoa. Look at a froggy. Hi. Okay. Can I pick anything up? This is just an experience. Oh, what's up? Ah, there you are. There I am. And look at you. Standing alone in the dark. Why? I am a terrible host. Here, take my life. I know my way around well enough without it. Don't be. Whoa, afraid. what the hell? What's up, dude? There is plenty to see. Need All you have to thing? do is look. Oh, but don't boy. be surprised if something looks back. Treasures Can I may open? hide Hi. in even the darkest corner. Yeah, what's the deal with that guy? Up. But don't let that concern you. <laughs> when it's time for lights out, what's this? Uh, you'll see. Well, I have a few deliveries. Oh, there now. <laughs> Good thing Roquefair is uh, out for the night. Maybe I do need a light in here. <laughs> well, well, my <laughs> friend. That's cool. See, see you later. Oh, you're a lot smaller than I thought you would be. See you later. You good boy. Wow, throwing stuff. Like, what am I? Your wings. See, like, why? What do these things do? Hmm. Cool. All right. Okay, great. Can I grab this? No? What was that? Alright. I mean, this... I've seen enough here. Thank you. <laughs> Thrilling stuff. Come on, lab. Come on, load. You can do it. You can do it. Load the game. All right, cool. Well, Test we only traveler got... has visited all experiments in Pocket Universe Lab Eight. And this is the thing that we did. Oh, you can move it. Let's go to Venice. It. A relic has been successfully modified in Pocket Universe Lab Fifty Six. <laughs> All right, we're just going to do one of these real quick, and then I think we're going to call it a day. It's Venice, it's the... Come on. Come on. 
See, my question is, did they go and take a 360 video and then, or like, pictures all around? Or did they like just fully make it computerized and that's... Look at that, and so, great. I mean, it's a really cool idea, for sure. I mean, I could see this being awesome, like ways to visit new places and stuff. Or just to see what it's like. I mean, it would be great if they did, uh, like, like the Louvre or something, like, all the way through where you could just walk through and check stuff out. All right. Well, anyway, that's that's it for the lab, I'd say. Um, what? What? Chill. Um, but, yeah, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if there's anything that you saw in this that you want me to do more of or you're, like, interested in making a specific video, like, whether, oh, like, see what high score I can get in like the slingshot thing or the arrow shooting thing or the, the little mini game thing in the beginning that I did uh, let me know uh, but again thanks so much for watching uh, I've been Sean Zom Gaming don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the bell and all that business alright cool thanks y'all later